Switch Station 32 here for another review. Today we're going to do Far Cry 5, the Collector's Edition Guidebook. Hardcover. It's a really nice book. Now we'll start with the stuff that it comes with. It just comes with a digital digital code for the ebook. And then it comes with a nice map of Hope County. It's like a real map. It has all the locations of your shrines and everything on it to be handy. Now into the good stuff. Starts off with a picture of this nice flag from Hope County. I've been playing this game for a couple of weeks. I don't want to give no spoilers away, but it's pretty good if you like Far Cry. The story is really good. Probably the best story I played in a shooting game in a long time, which is good. Because uh, shooters are missing out on story big time right now for multiplayer. Here's all the different people in the game. There's three main bad guys in this. You're the father, and then there's three kids. So once you defeat the three kids, then you fight father. I don't want to give away no spoilers of how any of that happens, though, but it's pretty good. This has all your cult outpost in it, all your shrines, where they are, how to get all your loot. Had it where to find all your keys. Pretty handy. I haven't went through it too much myself because I don't want to ruin the game for myself either. These are all different missions. Let me look them up. Game looks really good on PS4 Pro, by the way. Now, this is where you start off with this island. Now, you got to get off this island to get into the other part of the world. It's not really giving anything away because you're going to be told that just as soon as the game starts. It's not that bad, probably an hour, maybe two, depending on if you do everything. Now this is John's region, one of the kids, all the stuff that you can do and all the stories you can do to liberate John. The controls in this game are really good, really spot on. This is all uh, different stuff for John's location. I don't want to give it away. Now these are different story missions. You read all 
through this or you get stuck on any of it. It gives you nice little tips and uh, how to do it. It's a really nice book. The cover of it feels really good, almost like a rubber. Kind of like the God of War one I reviewed. So this is Jacob's region. The other side. And the same thing for him. All the different stuff, all everything you can do for Jacob. All the different side missions, characters, for anybody that wants to get 100% all your trophies in this game, this is going to be really handy. Here's another thing. It gives you tips on the best fishing locations and how to use your rods. And uh, this is really good for getting loot and selling to get better weapons. Better cars, better trucks. So this is a, will help you really a lot. All these different shrines and their locations because a lot of them are out in the open and a lot of them are hidden. And the one part of the story is to find all of these and destroy them. I know some people like grinding and other people don't like being stuck on stuff forever. So if you're the kind of person that don't like being stuck on stuff forever, this is a really good book for you. You don't really need it. The game explains it pretty good. The maps and everything of how you get to your different locations and stuff, but it does come in handy. Definitely collectible. It's a nice book. These are different regions. One, two, three, four, five. I don't exactly know what the fifth one is yet. I'm not that far into the game yet. And I don't want to ruin it for myself, so I'm not going to read it. And it has the daughter and father's region in here. I don't want to go uh, show you father's region because I know a lot of people don't want to get that spoiled. So these are all your different weapons, what they do, how you can upgrade them. All your different abilities, your torches, how you fix your vehicles, everything. different vehicles you can unlock every single time you get one of these you uh, you can go to your garage afterwards and just and get it anytime you want all your different helicopters boats planes everything's in here It's a good way to find stuff. If you don't know what you're missing, you can go in here and it will tell you. All your different characters. These characters really help you out in the game. I don't want to give away the story, but... This is the producer of God of War and what inspired him to for this. And 
some different world settings and art. Really nice. And these are father and the three kids. Beautiful artwork here. I'd say if you're a collector, this book is 100% one that you'd want. All the different characters. Here's some really nice artwork here. And they talk about making the game really good reads. And then it has a little bit even has a little bit even more about the arcade part of the game, which is pretty good. So you can even learn how to do that kind of stuff in here too. And one last picture, this is my favorite artwork of the whole book. And yes, that's another review from Switch Station 32. If you could leave a like and subscribe and help the channel out, that'd be great. And we did invest in some stuff to make a, improve the camera so it's not going to be shaky anymore. And that's it for another review.